So let's go ahead and add a rifle to our player. For that, if we open up the player main game object, then inside the amateur, let's open up hips, then spine, then spine one, spine two, then open up the right shoulder, then the right arm, right forearm, then right hand, then in the right hand, open this right hand thumb one, then the thumb two, then the right hand thumb three, then four, and right here in the right hand thumb four end, we will create a new empty game object by the name of rifle holder. Press enter. After this, let's close this right shoulder for now and open up the left shoulder, then left arm, left forearm, left hand, then left hand thumb one, thumb two, thumb three, Four, and then in the four end let's create an empty game object by the name of rifle holder as well because our player will be holding two guns at the same time so we need two rifle holders in both of the arms of the player so now let's minimize the left shoulder as well and open up the right shoulder there is the rifle holder so let's go ahead and click on guns folder and in the guns go inside prefab then gun models and here is all of the guns or you can say rifles so first of all we will add our gun okay in the right hand of the player so just drag and drop it inside the rifle holder then click on prefab and back completely and in the last, last video you guys noticed that we have added the gun animator to our player okay if we check the resources we have created the gun animator in the previous video so now we have added the gun as you can see we have the gun animator added and basically this will play the first animation which is this one okay so let's go ahead and play the game and as you can see it played this shooting animation you can see the player is in the shooting animation okay so now if we click on our gun okay and then get back to the scene view so that we can position our rifle or you can say gun so what we will do is to now simply make this gun position accurately so you can do the same as i am doing if your character and rifles are different then make sure that you do it according to your own game okay so let me just quickly do that and then i will show it to you so i think this looks good in the player arms as you can see it looks good like this okay and as you can see the player is holding the gun as you can see so now first gun is set accurately now let's do this for the other hand as well because our player will be holding two different guns so in the left shoulder left arm forearm hand and then left hand thumb one two three four and in the four last we have the rifle holder so what we can do is to simply duplicate this one okay and then drag and drop it inside the rifle holder of the other hand okay and then let's move the position of this gun to this hand and now let's position it correctly as well so as you can see it looks perfect like this okay we have both of the guns set correctly as you can see now guys don't stop the game because as you know that we are playing the game okay so that our player 
will be in the shooting animation and then we will set the guns as you can see right here we set it already okay now don't close the game first of all notice these values of both of the guns okay because if you st stop the game these values will be gone okay so just don't stop the game if you are using windows then open up the snipping tool or you can use your mobile phone and just capture these values okay or else you can do this is just simply copy the component okay but since we have two different guns so we need to take a screenshot of one of the guns so i will take the screenshot or uh, screenshot of this left hand gun okay so what i will do is to simply click on new and let me capture these okay so now as you can see we have a screenshot of the left hand gun and for the right hand what we can do is to simply copy the component values of it or you can actually take a screenshot of this one as well but i will simply click on copy component now if we stop the game you will notice that our gun is gone and our gun position is now gone as well so we have the right hand gun so what we will do we will simply paste the values as you can see the values is being pasted okay you can notice it and now what we can do is to actually duplicate this again and move it inside the rifle holder okay so drag and drop in inside the rifle holder now we have these values so let's type these values so for the position x it was minus 0 0.0564 and then for the other one it was it was minus 0 0.0424 and then for the z it was minus 0 0.0416 okay then let's change the rotation of it as well to minus 55 point zero one one let's change this the x per rotation to two one two point nine three nine and then this one to sixty three point five six nine and now everything is set up already okay so now what we can do is to play the game again and now you will notice the guns will be in the same direction in which we have added as you can see if you check the scene view there are the guns okay already being set up now so what we what you have to do is to simply add the animator okay to the player right here and then play the game and set up all of your guns in one position as you saw in this video and after setting it correctly copy the values or you can actually take a screenshot of it and then paste that values again when the game is being stopped okay so that the values saved okay so now we have the guns added okay and the next thing which we need to do is to add some shooting to our rifles.